Yo, what's going on, y'all? Um, so, I know why you're here. Uh, I know what you want to know. And uh, you're going to find out why I got banned on NBA 2K19. Yeah, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Also, don't forget to like the video and enjoy. So, on April 16th, uh, the day before my wedding anniversary, I log into NBA 2K19 and I try to quote and unquote grind my character or quote and unquote drop off some dudes on twos. And I couldn't log in, I was banned. Um, I'm going to show you guys the message that I got from 2K on my PlayStation 4. Right on screen right now. So when I got this message, not only was I in awe, I thought that it was all a, a joke. I thought that April Fools came a little bit late and that 2K was just trolling your boy. But then as the message begins to fade out and I go into the menus, I couldn't connect to the 2K server. Um, it literally told me to start over of my career offline as well as the my team and the my league options were not listed on my game it was like i wasn't connected to the internet now of course me being me i didn't get too you know like heart racing palpitations i was like hold up it might be something going on so i closed the app i restart my ps4 i run a test on psn making sure i'm on the internet I even go to the PlayStation store like, oh, okay, okay, PlayStation want me to buy something, so I must be connected. So I dive right back into 2K. And yeah, I got that message again. This time, I had my headphones on, and it was like this, I don't know, it was like this weird gunshot or weird, like, thunder type sound. And that Jones was like, yo, my man, you out here. So what I then did was... I, I let it set in for a moment. I called all my friends, uh, Chase, Ricky, Trey, Raunchy, Mark, Rambo, uh, Ken. Like I was, I was basically talking to everybody in the cell squad about what was going on at that moment. And I was like, man, I don't know what's about to happen. And I don't know how I'm going to get my account back. And I thought that the reason why I got banned was because I was previously hacked on PlayStation probably about four or five times this year. Now, when I get hacked, I may be online, I may be out of state, I may be out the country like I am right now. I'm in Aruba. So I'm thinking like, nah, I got hacked last week. It, it, it couldn't have been me. They must have did something shady on my account. Let me go find out what's going on. So. I immediately hit up the contacts that I know over at 2K. I hit up Ronnie 2K. I hit up the recently uh, brought back LD 2K. I even hit up Constant. A lot of people might not know, but Constant now is uh, working over at 2K. So, you know, big shout out to him. But, you know, I hit them up and, you know, I keep everything cool, quiet, calm, collective. You know what I'm saying? A few hours go by and I'm like, man, these dudes ain't hit me back. Now, you got to remember... I'm on East Coast time. This happened around like one o'clock. So like basically their work day is just about getting started. And I'm like, you know what? I'm not going to stress it. I'm going to wait for a response. I'm going to wait till somebody hit me back. And, you know, hopefully they can find out what's going on. So, you know, a couple hours go by and, you know, now I'm starting to, you know I'm saying, you know, you know, once you need to tap into the vein, you know, that vein, I'm like, yo, like I ain't played the game all day. You know what I'm saying? I'm going in and out of the, the game, opening the app, closing the app, getting the same message. I'm like, man, ain't nothing happening. So I'm like, you know what? It's time to go ahead and use my, my, my social media prowess real quick. So I put out a little Twitter uh, statement, you know, letting everybody know that I got banned. Um, a couple other people got banned that I know, um, especially C4 Board, he had got banned. Um, they say that he was VC glitching when... In all actuality, he said that he was in the stage winning tons of VC on stream even. And they thought that when his account got flagged by whatever system that they have, 
they thought he was VC glitching. So I'm not sure if he did. I'm, I just know what he told me. He told me he did not do it. So he said that everything should be rectified as soon as possible. And I was like, you know what? Maybe it'll be the same situation for me. So after I put the tweet out, I started getting, you know, admiration, people pouring in saying, yo, they couldn't have got the OG like that. That's crazy. I've probably been playing this game for so long. What's going on? And I'm like, man, I'm getting all this love. I'm just hoping I can get my account back. Like, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to everybody that said free iPod. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> they told me to make t-shirts the whole down. I'm just, I'm just thanking them for, you know, even responding back to the tweet, retweeting it, sending it to Ronnie, sending it to LD, sending it to Mike Wang, you know, showing love and support. So, you know, that night I was like, man, I can't, I can't take being banned. Like, I, I can't take it. Like, this, this is hard. Like, this is not only the main game that structures the source of my income from YouTube and Facebook gaming, but I also have fun playing 2K. Like, this year's 2K is not like last year's 2K. This year's 2K is really, really good. Last year's 2K, whew, hot trash. This year's 2K had me actually wanting to become an Elite 3 at the park. Like, no game really be wanting me to, you know, meet its requirements and standards to say I'm one of the good characters or I play against comp and this and that and stage and all that. This year, this game was good. So, I decided to go ahead and create a new PSN or, in, in turn, use one of my old accounts, rename it with the new PlayStation update where you can change your name, and I created a new account. I'm not going to tell you guys that account. If you see it in some of my videos, then you'll see it in some of my videos. But um, I streamed on Facebook Gaming uh, the next day. Now, we're already 24 hours in, so this is the 17th. Um, I stream on Facebook Gaming. Yeah, the link to my Facebook definitely will be in the description. Definitely follow my page. That's where you get all your streams at. But um, so I was like, you know what? Let me address the situation real quick. And, you know, I was just telling people inside the stream that I would never. And this is not because... I feel like I'm better than anybody or, you know, I just got different type of clout or whatever. You know, the, the new thing kids are talking about, clout this, clout. I don't worry about all that. I build relationships with people and companies to the point where I can just ask a simple question. Please tell me what happened. Please tell me why. And please tell me, is there anything that can be done? So when I reached out to people at 2K, I didn't reach out to 2K support because I heard so many different occasions that 2K support talks down on people. They are not willing to help people. They will close tickets on you. They will literally send an email to a dummy email and not your own email saying that the ticket was responded to. Uh, they would talk to whoever owned the account and there was nothing that they can do to resolve it. So when it came to me reaching out to 2K support about a problem that I had about getting banned, I was like, I'm not taking no chances, no chances at all. So I reached out to LD and, you know, he said, hang tight. You should have seen the sweat that was rolling down my face when he said that. So, you know, like I told you guys, I streamed on Facebook told everybody what happened to me. I don't know what I did. I don't know what happened. I, I don't know anything. All I know is that I reached out to somebody at 2K to see if they could help me with my situation. So moving along, um, I'm playing with my new character. I'm playing with my new... Um, so moving along in the story, I'm playing with my new account and I'm having a ton of fun. Me and Ken are running twos with my new account. Newly rejuvenated, I spent $75 on a VC um, coupon from Amazon. Got the character up to like 87 overall. I'm just grinding, busting my behind, making sure that I'm about to start dropping content for you guys on YouTube again and trying to get back into it. Trying to get back into YouTube is so hard because every time I have an idea, it feels like either the idea has been done so many times from either me or other creators along the years of this, this these games that I'll just I'll always be like, man, I don't want to make that. But this new lockdown just provides so much content for YouTube that I could talk about. So like I was saying, I was playing with the lockdown or whatever the case may be. 
and my DMs open up. You know what I'm saying? One DM in, 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 in like one certain DM, like one DM that I had my eyes on. LD2K hits me up and he was like, yo, bro, um, I seen that you were having a problem with your account and I want you to log on to your PS4 right now and check to see if you are back online and able to play. When I got that DM, I almost called LD2K. Like I literally almost grabbed my phone, go to my contacts and hit the call button. Because when I logged on to PS4, after about 24 hours of being banned, I got my account back. And I know, I know a lot of people are probably gonna say, you know, it's crazy how I got banned and iPod got banned, but iPod got his account back in 24 hours. I still haven't gotten my account back or they've told me two weeks or they've told me a month. All that I can say is, if you have been banned by 2K, this is the time where you get active in the comment section. If you got banned by 2K and you did nothing wrong and you know without a shadow of a doubt that you did nothing wrong, I want you to put inside the chat your PSN and I just want you to put N slash A, which means N-A. So if you put your PSN in there, I will literally bring this list to 2K. I will take these list of names of people who think for sure that they have never done anything wrong on their accounts. I will take this list and send it to people at 2K asking for accounts to be unbanned. Now, if you've done something and you say that they've either put you on a, a few week ban or a month ban or whatever the case may be, do your time. You good. You're going to get your account back. But if you don't, hit me up again and say, hey man, they told me they were going to give me my account back and they haven't given it back yet and leave your PSN in the comment section. For those that have done something and maybe they dealt with a uh, uncooperative 2K support uh, agent or whatever the case may be and they got perma banned or something like that, if you got perma banned and you were doing something you weren't supposed to do, I really don't know if I can help you, if you know what I mean, because I feel like um, there was one person in particular that came to my Facebook stream and he hit me up and he was like, yo, like he was in the comments. He said, bro, he said, I straight up told them, I know what I did. I, I, I know for sure what I did. I know I was wrong. And I just want to know when can I get my account back? He said he didn't play dumb to 2K support. He didn't act like he didn't know what happened. And he was just dumbfounded. It was like, oh, my God. He said he didn't do none of that. He said he kept it straightforward. He said he kept it correct. You know what I'm saying? He, he, he walked into that chat with his balls in his hand. I, I don't know if I could have been the same. You know what I'm saying? Going in that joint with your balls in. I don't know. You know what I mean? But he said he did that. And he said that they gave him a month ban and that he'll be back shortly. Now, uh, there's all type of glitches in the game for 2K19. There's, you know, uh, badge glitches, VC glitches, rep glitches even, uh, Gatorade glitches. I don't think, I think there may be a boost glitch, but I think it only worked for the park. Um, there's... There's not demigod glitches. They're not animation uh, purchase glitches. But there's the layers. There's uh, booters. Like, th it's, it's so much in this year's game. And I know that I'm one of those people that always talk to the community. Try to keep you guys updated on what's going on inside the world of 2K. But honestly... I haven't been shining light on everything that's been going on because I didn't want to go down that line as one of those people that only talk about the exploits in a video game. Because when you do things like that, like for instance, if I get hacked on PSN and I come out with a video saying I got hacked and you know, does that not make myself a target for the next hacker? You know what I mean? Like I feel like that type of stuff right there is real taboo. You know what I mean? Like if you give people a chance to say, hold up, you got hacked? Oh, I might, I might, I might fuck with it too. Like, I don't like that stuff, man. I'm a simple person, yo. I don't like getting into 
arguing with people. I don't get into all that. Like, yeah, I might argue with some of my sales squad homies, but after our argument is over, literally the next minute, we're done, we're laughing, we're chatting, we're talking about, like, I don't beef with people and all that. Like, I don't get into none of that. So with all the stuff that's going on in 2K, I feel like that's 2K's job to fix. You feel what I mean? Like, if they're out here banning accounts, they should also hold themselves accountable for what exploits are still in the game until this day. Because if you, as a company, don't hold yourself uh, responsible and you just ban a bunch of accounts, that's like saying, okay, you buy a $60 game, but with this one of your main accounts or whatever, you might have spent $120 on VC. I'm sorry, that's now our $120 for microtransactions, go ahead, create a new account and spend another $120. I feel like that rinse, wash and repeat type of remedy does not work. I feel like if 2K knows that there's a bug or a glitch or whatever the case may be, they should come out with a statement saying that this is an exploit. This is something that's in our game and let people know if you do it, you're at fault. Or they could say, hey, there's something that's in our game that is broken at the moment. We are working on it and we will have an update shortly. And for those that may do whatever they're doing for that time period or whatever, give them like a temporary ban or whatever the case may be. But don't, don't permanent ban people for a quick little thing because I tend to see what happens is people come out with YouTube videos with like glitches and stuff like that, exploits and stuff like that. And I promise you, People like my son, tender young children. Yeah, I said it, tender young children. 10 year olds, nine year olds, 11 year olds, 12 year olds, even teenagers, 13, 14, 15. They watch these videos and they say to themselves like, bro, like my mom got me going to school. She got me in basketball, football or baseball, hockey, lacrosse, whatever sports, swimming, whatever you get into. She got me going to reading and comprehension classes. She got me in math classes, tutor, all this. I don't have the time to grind my character in the 99, but I want to be in 99. So guess what they're going to do when it comes to grind your character or find an easy way out? They're going to try to find an easy way out. And then they're going to ask their mom for that credit card, spend that VC, and try to get their character up as fast as possible, and then get banned. You know what I mean? So, like, I, I, I think I've rambled for a little while now. I'm sorry if this video is super duper long. If you were banned or anything like that, reach out to me inside the comment section. Let's see if we can get something resolved. No, I do not work for 2K, but I do work for the community. Yeah, you know I mean, so I am the OG of this shit. I've been in this for so long and I just want to make sure that people get what they've been working for. You know what I mean? If you've been out here grinding, like I heard the dude got banned like a few weeks ago. He was literally doing 24 hour streams of playing my career and he got banned because he was doing so many my career games and they didn't know if he was accumulating his rep off of a glitch or not. And a bot probably flagged it as, yo, he earned too much VC and rep inside of one day. That is, that's beyond me. But uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you leave a like. Reach out to me in the comment sections if you've been banned. And uh, I guess I'm still the reason. Yeah. You can't watch this whole video without subscribing.